그냥 너가 그리네. 이렇게. No, I didn't c a b l e I am still in the village. Olivia, hmm? where are you coming from at this time? No, my way to work, isn't it obvious? You're going to work? Oh, is this when married women will come to their homes? Huh? Mama, I'm sorry. It's just that I had lots of work to do at the office. You know, it's the end of the quarter, so there's just so oh, much... Oh, shut your mouth! Tell that to that fool you married and not me. Not me. You cannot fool me. You cannot fool me! I know what you bankers do. I know! Especially those of you that work in marketing departments. No, 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 Mama. See, it's not what you think, okay? See, you see, because... You see what? Olivia, you see what? I don't blame you. I don't at all. You've exhausted your energy at work. What energy do you have left for my son? Olivia! Olivia! When will you be able to concentrate and get pregnant for my son? When? Mama, please, Mama, please, let's not go there. Mama, please. Mama, I just I, I, I just got back from work. Are you just getting in? Can I at least drop, drop my bag? I'm not even drop my bag or anything. Then we can continue with all of this, please. Oh, you know what? I am nagging, eh? What? Then I should continue nagging, Olivia. Eh? In actual sense, you are telling me to shut up my mouth and continue later. Is that what you're saying? I should shut my mouth and continue later. Eh? Is that what? Is that what you're saying? I should shut up my mouth and continue later. Mama, please let me just go in. Let me just drop my things. Excuse me. Mama, please. Mama, please. Sorry, excuse me. Hey, Mama. I'm not going to be so good. I'm not going to be so g o o Oh. Babe, why didn't you tell me that your mom was coming or that she was around? Understand. Does my mom need permission from anyone to visit her son's house? That is not what I mean, okay? You called me earlier. You could have just told me that she was at home, so that I won't be caught unawares. And would that have made you return home earlier? What? w i t I'm the man of the house. And this is my house. My mom doesn't need anyone's approval to visit her son's house. What is wrong with you? Like, who exactly do I look like I'm trying to drag the whole position of being the man of the house with you? I'm simply saying that, c o n s i d e r the man that you, you should tell me when your mom or a relative is coming to, to visit us in the house so that I will know, okay? This house is as much as mine as it is yours. As you know, think this is my house. Let's not delve towards that direction to avoid anyone being provoked. Are you serious? Yes, I'm being serious. So you, you can't see anything wrong in what you did? Then I ask again. Will it have made you return home earlier? Hell no. Case closed. Oops. Thank you. Mama, is everything okay? Mm. So no, I don't like the food though. Mm? But look at the time your, your, your wife is giving me food. I'm supposed to be resting on my bed. And she's giving me food to eat by this time. Eh? Mama, please, I'm, I'm sorry. Please, please forgive me. It's not going to repeat itself again. Mm -hmm. It's not as if I'm angry. I am not. But eating by this time is not good for our health. Yes, everybody. See, the food we eat is supposed to nourish your body, produce vitamin that will make you accept pregnancy. Eh, uh -huh, now. Uh, eating by this time will make the food a uh, waste. Yes. That explains why my son is wasting his hard work on you. Yeah? For two years of marriage, nothing to show, nothing, no child, nothing. Please stop that, c o p r i t e s 
we'll see what you're coming back from work later as we can see. If I talk now, you say I talk too much. But it's clear now, Mama just can't put it out right. You hear it from another party. Mama, please, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I promise it won't repeat itself. Mm, what do I do? I am managing the food now. That's exactly what I'm doing. Eh? I am not know what to do. Eh? I told you so. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to No, no, no. What's the meaning of this now? What's the problem? You're tired. Every time you're always tired, you're always complaining of tiredness. You don't even know if today happens to be the, the, the lucky day you finally get to conceive. Babe, just calm down, okay? I just said I'm tired. I wish you try later. I'm not trying I'm anything tired. later. What if I'm not in the mood? Babe, I don't understand what's going on. Why don't you always look like when your mom is around you? you you get angry easily and you, over, you always overreact. What's that supposed to mean? No, no, what are you trying to insinuate? That my mom is not a good person? Is that what you're trying to say? Babe, I don't know if that's how you're seeing it. To be honest, I don't know. It's just that... I just said we should try later, okay? But if you insist on doing it now, fine, I'm, I'm here, just do it. What was that supposed to mean? You just scatter yourself like that and you just stay like that. I'll come and start banging you with no emotions. No soundtrack, no money, nothing. No feelings. Babe, I don't understand you. Yeah, what is it? I said we should wait so that I can rest a bit and we'll try later. You say no. I said, okay, come and do it since you want it now. You're complete. Babe, I don't have this energy, please. I don't know what to say anymore. Please, just decide. Olivia. What are we having for breakfast? Um, I made tea and bread for breakfast, then rice and soup for morning. Hmm. Olivia, hey mama. Huh? Hey mama. Anyway, that one is prepared is for you and your husband. For me, Bozo. I want to eat pounded yam and the goosey soup. Um, but Mama, I can't make that now because I'm rushing to work. Please, can you wait till evening? <laughs> I don't understand. So, you are saying that I should wait till you come back from work for me to eat? Is that what you're telling your mother in law? Eh? Yeah? Mama? Eh? What is it? No, I can't go. I came into the kitchen this morning. I saw your wife. I asked her, what are we having for breakfast? She said she prepared tea and bread for breakfast and rice and stew for lunch. I told her, I don't want those things that I want to eat pounded yam and a goosey soup. Do you know what she told me? That I should wait until she returns from work in the evening. Babe, what is there in making pounded yam and ekusi now? Oh, you can do it. Go ahead and make it. Well, babe, I can't make her pounded yam and ekusi this morning because I'm running late for work already. So I asked her to wait till I'm back this evening, so I'll make it for her. Are you trying to say that if Mama doesn't want to eat what you've prepared, that she will stay hungry? Kachi, please don't start. Don't do what you're about to do right now, please. You and I know very well that I can't make 
pounded jam and add soup this, this morning. I'm running late to work already. I already made breakfast and I asked her to please wait till evening. Please don't do this. I'm running late for work. I need to go. She has to. She has to. She has to. Mama, please, I'm, I'm running late, okay? I can't continue to explain myself there, okay? And, and I've been explaining myself to you, and it's not like you're trying to reason with me. If I, if I keep staying there and explaining myself, I, I, I won't get to the office later, and I'll get into trouble, oh, please. I don't have sense, Emma. I don't have sense, Olivia. Do you know that walking out on your mother-in-law is enough reason for me to pack into your father's house? If you had done this in the village. Mama, excuse myself, eh? Okay, Mama, please, can I go now? Eh! Oh, I know you want to go. Yes, you want to go so that you go and continue where you stopped. Yes? Where you stopped servicing those your big, big customers. Isn't it? Eh! Don't touch me! Don't touch me! I knew it. It was a wrong decision when my son decided to marry you. A banker. Not just a banker. A marketer. I know what you people do now. People go about sleeping with big, big men. So they will come, hey, don't look at me like that. So they will come and deposit money in your account so that you become a manager overnight. Yes. See, your days are numbered in this house. Because you don't even have anything to show. No time. No pregnancy, not even a miscarriage. Well, catch it. I'm over miscarriage. <laughs> not even a miscarriage. Who knows? If I have destroyed all the eggs in your womb with this bad. Wait, 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 stop, stop, stop. Finish. This bad drugs you're taking. Just to avoid pregnancy and then flush unwanted babies. Eh? What are you? Only that jebe. Yes, I know, Molly. Um, Say those hurtful words to her. She will feel bad now and she won't be happy at work. Shut up your mouth there. <laughs> eh? That girl is too stubborn. So those mayways will not do anything to her. You are truly too blind to see the truth. I mean, you keep saying this truth, 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 truth. I don't know what truth exactly are you talking about. Ah, Kachi. Kachi, you are really blind. Do you know what these bankers do? What? You don't know. Let me tell you. Let me open your eyes to all these things. You see, when they finish good gallivanting, servicing their customers, they will come home so tired they have nothing to offer. But you see me, I am in the city. A wigum, like a guilo. I am going nowhere. Okay, for all my daughter-in-laws. They must give me grandchildren. Until they do so, I will never let them rest. Anyone who refuses to comply, hmm, we have it fire for fire from me. Hey, man. Eh? Another man, John Sobun. Okay, man, Mara, John Sobun. What do you about? Honey, she needs to calm down. The symptoms she spoke about are actually not pregnancy symptoms. Yeah, they are malaria symptoms. Babe, but I felt like throwing up. The reason I thought I was pregnant. 
I know. Um, this is your malaria test result. Come on, babe. Relax. You don't need to bother yourself or give yourself unnecessary pressure. We've checked your system. It's good and so are mine. In due time, we'll have our babies, okay? You don't have to stress about it. Besides, I'm not even complaining. So why don't you, you know, see another doctor? Mm -hmm. My husband is a doctor, remember? It means I'm doubting my own husband. Look, my husband takes the same test as much as I do. If I do that, it means I'm doubting him. His results are fine, I've seen it. We are both okay. Oh, well, you have a point, you know? And even lucky that your mother-in-law, she's so caring and understanding. I know so many women in your shoes that their mother-in-laws are giving them hell. <laughs> ah, I thank God so much for my mother-in-law. Uh -huh. God bless that woman. Mm -hmm. That woman, oh my God, I'm so lucky to have her. She pets me like a baby. Mm -hmm. She treats me like, you know, I just got married to her son yesterday. Oh. Every woman would want to have her as their mother-in-law. Uh -huh. But girl, I'm just, I'm too lucky to have her. I'm too, too lucky. Oh. <laughs> I'm very lucky, my dear. My own mother-in-law, she gave me hell of trouble the first year marrying her son. Well, thank God I gave birth the following year. Mm. The new one she's bringing now is that she needs three children. <laughs> that if she didn't give birth to her third child, my husband will not be born. <laughs> Can you imagine? You know your last pregnancy was crazy for you. It was hell. So please, if you have the strength to go again, do. But if you don't, don't even stress yourself. I am not even thinking or oh, trying. Talk about attempting. <laughs> they wanted a son and I've given to them. Case closed. Exactly. <laughs> so hair is nice anyways. Thank you. Like you've not seen it before. It's so old hair now. I'm fine. Where are you? Oh, I'm on my way to have a meeting with the client. Where are you having a meeting? At Mi Park Hotel. Why are you asking? Is there a problem? Wait, so you left I and my mom at home and you went to the hotel to go have a meeting with another man. While you left I and my mom starving here at home. Start heading home. Oh, babe, I said I'm going for a meeting. I said start heading home immediately. Sir, um, please, sir, can we reschedule the meeting? I have a family emergency, please. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. I'm grateful. Yes, thank you. A few minutes. Few minutes she was running home. See, this is how you show her that you are the man of this house. You are the man of this house. My name is Uzoma. I will show you the right parts. Hmm? You are the man of this house. Act like one, Kachi. Act like one. Me, 
For me to think that you normally come back from work early every day. When we all know that you are a night crawler, eh? <laughs> Only God knows if you did not enter the club to do chicky chicky with your Mama. customer. I shut your mouth. But you know, and you left my son here lonely, like a married bachelor. Who does that? Mama. Catch it. In my mana patch also go. Okay, ma. I was one today. I bought pound yam. Trust me, it takes exactly like the pound of yam, and that is what we eat. <laughs> Olivia, I want to eat pound yam. Not all these refined yam flowers you buy from the market. I want to eat pound yam with a goose soup. You better go back to the market, buy real yam, boil it and pound it for me like an African woman because that is what I will eat and that is what my son will eat. Mama, please, I'm, I'm sorry, but it's not possible. I can't go to the market now. and oh, I don't even have the strength to pound yam after work. But trust me, you're going to like this and this is what we've been eating, Mama. <laughs> I want that's what to eat. I don't even have the strength to pound yam, Mama. How do I blame you? I don't blame you! How will you have strength when you have exhausted all your energy at work? Hey, mama. Who did it? Hey, mama. Wait. So you're saying if I can't eat the refined yam flour, I should starve? Hey, what? Mama, that is your choice to make. Eh? But mama, please, can I just make the soup and powder yam because it's getting late. Then when I'm done, you will decide. Eh? Hey, is that what you're saying? Is that what you're saying? We shall see. See this nonsense you have prepared. I hope that's what will go inside. Yes, Mama, I bought it. That's what will go inside. Yeah. Mm. Mama, I don't want to eat this. I don't want to eat this. I don't want Make us a delicious dinner, okay? So go and rest. Babe, um, what do you want me to do? I'll, I would like to help. Absolutely nothing. 
I don't want you to do anything. I mean, it's all on me, okay? Baby, are you sure you don't want me to do anything? Come on, babe. All right, go, 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 go. <laughs> okay, baby. <laughs> from NYSC. <laughs> it's time to enter the labor market. The oh, labor market. market. The real life. <laughs> you know what? We're going to start job hunting immediately. I'll ask um, some of my customers. I'm sure they'll have job vacancies. Mm. Some. You Come see why I love you. Stop it. Salud. I your lady herself. <laughs> Stop it. That's why you're my sis. Come on. Oh my. You look good. What are you cooking? I'm making pao no yama nebusisu. Don't worry. I'm sure you have some. Let me join you. It's fine. Come on. You just go back, okay? I'll see you when the night sets. Okay. Yes, you don't say so. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright. See, so let me freshen up. Sure. Nice to see you again, sister. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. By the way, Mama is in town. Oh, really? She's at Kachi's house. When did she come? She came in yesterday. I'll be mm. picking her up tomorrow. Oh my God, I've missed Mama so much. I can't mm. wait to see her. I know. Well, you see her soon so that both of you can drown yourself in each other's love. <laughs> Do I sense jealousy? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, jealous. Come on, you know I'm way bigger than that. I hear Are you, you feeling the food? I love it. It's really delicious. For in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay. What is this? Eh? I said I want pounded yam. What is this one? Mama, that is what she made. Or oh, are you seeing something else? I said, shut your mouth. I said, I want to eat pounded yam. I told her to go to the market, buy yam, real yam. Boil and pound it for me. Pound it inside mortar for me. And she went and prepared all this uh, processed food. But, just because of her laziness. Yeah, mama. Honey, why didn't you pound yam for us to eat? You know, these refined foods are not good for our health. Exactly. Exactly what I'm talking about. All these canned and refined foods, they're not good for our health. No, wait, Mama, wait, wait. When did you stop eating yam flour? Shut your mouth. Machado, machado, cigar, yaba. Felicia, are you the one that will tell me what to eat and what not to eat? Huh? I said, I want to eat pounded yam. Not all these refined food you will eat in the city. Huh? But she decided to prepare this one because she's lazy to pound these bones. Oh God. So you're not going to eat this one because it's, it's processed food? Mama just said it now. And I can say for a matter of fact that it's not good for my health. Hey! Are we eating it? Um, Mama, what is I'm so sorry for serving you processed food. Please, can you... Can you just manage and eat this one and after today we can start with the holding feeding, please? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, do. Are you saying you don't want to pound the arm? So you want Mama and I to starve, right? Is that what you're trying to say? Catch. What? Kachi, I can count and name the number of canned and refined food we eat in this house and we'll keep eating. From the soft drinks, to the soya beans, to the sausages, to the canned beef, to everything. To the beer you even take. I remember very well the first time you had this, this powder you have, this refined one, you told me that it was smooth and you preferred, you preferred it because he had to save me the stress of having to pound yam. So what is all of this? What is going on? And no problem for, for tonight. Let's just 
eat this one and manage it like that because of the soup. But next time, Mama says she wants pounded yam. You make pounded yam like a real African woman. Yeah. You pound it well. I'll just eat it. Next time, I'll see you baby. It's fine. Just let us eat. It's nice. It's nice. Mama eats now. Hmm? It's nice. How many did you want? I'm gonna have just a little more. Hey, as much as we complained, I don't know if I still have some left in the kitchen. If you are very stupid, Kachi, you are very stupid! I didn't even wait for you to let me in. But anyway, you're my sister. There's nothing I've not seen before. What the? Yeah. I said what I said. So, what is it you said you went to see me? Yes. Yes. Okay, see. I know you're way older than me and you have more life experience, obviously, than I do. But can I advise you on something? Are you okay? Of course you can. You're my sister. So if there is anything you feel like you want to tell me or maybe I'm going astray or anywhere, you've always got my back. I can always say it. It's good to know I have such support in your life. Okay. It's about your relationship with your wife whenever Mama is around. Did my wife tell you anything? You know you women like to gossip. See, Olivia didn't have to say anything to me. I have eyes, duh. They are big, I can see. See ya. See. I know Mama doesn't like your wife for whatever reasons best known to her. But you not being able to manage the situation whenever she's around is a mess. It's not good. Wait, you mean I join Mama in taunting my wife? Is that what you're trying to insinuate? That I disrespect her and her profession as a banker? And I was stood up for her this morning when Mama said hostful words towards her. You see? What am I not saying? I wasn't even there this morning when that transpired. So whatever it is I saw this evening, correspond with whatever it is you said happened this morning. Huh? Talking down on your wife and her efforts whenever Mama is around is not good. See, Mama is going to go back to the village oh, and it's going to be just you and Olivia in this house. So you have to treat her properly, take good care of her, protect her at all costs. Um, Felicity or Felicia, um... Wait, so you don't know my name again? It's fine, sorry about that. I don't know what you've seen or whatever you must have heard. You just returned. And I wouldn't delve into any argument of any sort with you. By the way, is this the reason you wanted to see me? I don't understand. Is this not enough reason? Brother! So because I'm small and I cannot advise you, Your son is taking care of me now. <laughs> so what? You're tired. It's not about the one. I want to know the cream setup. I will use it so that my skin will glow like your skin. <laughs> um, Mama, let's go inside. Let's go upstairs. We're going to talk more and get it. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Bad manners. <laughs> See, my dear. You need to be patient. Relax. Don't worry yourself. Children will come. God will give you children at his own time, okay? Mama. Mm? But I have every reason to be worried. 
Five years in marriage is not a joke. <laughs> That's five years. See, if not that my son is a medical doctor, I would have taken you to doctors or laboratories myself for tests to make sure that everything is okay. But he's a medical doctor now. He knows better. I mean, we've done all those tests. Mm. And the test result from the hospital laboratory proves that everything is okay with us. You see? You see? Then just relax and be happy. Don't be worried. Okay? All you need is to be patient. God will give you children. At his own time, as I said before. Look at you. Do you know how long I stayed before I gave birth to your husband? For just five years. And you're complaining. Do you know if I stayed longer? But today, I have four children. Do I? I lost a family. The one between Kachi and Felicia. But I'm happy that today I have three strong and agile children. Eh? Don't worry. Your own turn will come, okay? And you will have them. And I will carry my grandchildren from you. So they have to smile for me. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mama. Thank you, my dear. You're such a nice woman. Mm -hmm. You're the best mother-in-law in the whole wide world. Every woman will want to have you as one. And Mama, Olivia and I, we're so happy to have you as a mother-in-law. Mm. And we're happy to be married to your sons as well. <laughs> See, you're blushing. That's very correct. And I'm my John Sobu. And my John Sobu. That's very correct. Just because my children are good children, oh. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, give me a knife over there. Let me cut this vegetable, oh. oh. Yeah. <laughs> Olivia, I'm surprised at what you're saying, oh. Because that is not the mama that I know. The mama that I know joins me to cook. What? In fact, sometimes she even does the cooking while I watch her. She's the best mother-in-law any woman could ever wish for. How is that even possible? Wait, are you trying to tell me that she doesn't tell you the food she eats and she wants she doesn't? Like she doesn't tell you, she, she doesn't complain about you making processed food for her. She hasn't told you to pound yam for her before. <laughs> me, pound yam? Where's the strength now? In my house, what we eat is yam flour or semo. In fact, sometimes she prepares it herself. Wait, it means, with everything you're saying, it means that Mama has double standard. Like, Belinda, you don't understand. There is nothing I do that pleases this woman, nothing. She complains about my food. She complains about my job. She, she, she literally says that I, I sleep with my workers because I'm a marketer that works at the bank. Like, I just feel like she hates me for, for no reason. I don't know why. So, in all of these, where's your husband? Kachi. Kachi doesn't say anything. At times, he even supports his mother. But what is so weird is that when the mother isn't around, for good, we don't quarrel, he doesn't complain about anything. Yo, this thing you're telling me, it, it's, it's hard for me to believe. It just... It just means one thing. I think she she probably likes you and maybe she hates me for reasons best known to her because right now I don't I don't even know what to think or say anymore. Look, I'm not saying you're lying. It's just that if if Mama is two faced, which means I don't know. I don't know. Have you? <laughs> so you finally decided to come and see your brother and his wife, eh? Ah, mama, must you bring my leg out every time? <laughs> oh, it's so good to see you. So good to see you too. <laughs> By the way, congratulations. I heard you're done with your service. So yes, how yes, was it? How was yes, it? Yes, yes. It was really nice. At least I'm done with this phase. Now I'm ready to enter the labor. No.
Table market. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you look good. Thank you. What? Thank you, thank you, my brother's thank you, thank you. money. <laughs> thank yes, you so mama. much. Um, he's inside. Why don't you just make yourself comfortable? Let me get you something. Okay, sure. <laughs> it go nowhere, my darling. Hey, um, bolo mum. Hmm. Ria kunje jeba. Sit down. I know what you like, okay? Yes. Come in. Thank you, dear. Wow, this is a good song. This is the Talibot that one was growing up, our mother used to give it to us. Said so it's a very good medicine. I said we should do things with the cake in there. Um, Mama, but does this bitter leaf water work as medicine? Because I hear medical practitioners say it's harmful on our organs. What about them, Joe? How come our organs are not damaged? Eh, how come? So, my mother took it very well. For me, because of the bitterness. I pretend to call and collect from my mother. But I never really drink it because of the bitterness. <laughs> oh, very, very. You want to join us in the kitchen? No, no, it's fine. Okay, I don't want to ruin this mother and daughter-in-law moment. But meanwhile, can I talk to you for a minute? Yeah, how do you come now? No, everything's fine. Okay. <laughs> Come on, come on, Um, Mama, let me just take over. Hey, just put that one. No, 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 please don't fall your hands. This is our country from where I stopped, okay? Okay, Mama. Moro, Mam. Oh, Oh, yeah, Queen Jay, Jemba. Oh. Just hold on. Don't touch anything. This thing is very hot, okay? Okay, Mama. Just hold on, I'm coming. Okay. Oh, yeah, let's go. Okay. Is it just me, or you're being too nice to Belinda? But she's my daughter-in-law. Eh? I'm not disputing that fact. She's your daughter-in-law. But that's not how you treat Olivia. Mm -hmm. You insult Olivia at any given opportunity. Nothing she does pleases you. I don't think she's just married for two years. And Melinda has been married for five years. Yet you keep disturbing Olivia to give you grandchildren. Meanwhile, you treat Belinda like a queen. You eat whatever she makes. Do anything she wants you to do without complaining. Ah, uh, Mama. I think you should give Olivia some space so she can calm down, settle down, and conceive. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so, is that why you said you want to see me? Huh? Because if that is why you said you want to see me, as you can see, I am very busy. I am not ready for your nonsense, okay? Mama, eh? I'm just trying to point out the obvious between you and your daughter-in-law. You've done that, okay. And moreover, that is not the reason why I said I want to see you. Mm. What is it? I know you will like this one. Yeah, shoot. Uh, let me hear it first. Okay. So the guy I have been seeing uh -huh. wants to take the relationship to the next level. So I said, let me come and tell you and brother first. At least, thank God you are not in the village. So he doesn't have to go to the village to come see you. So let me come and inform you and brother. You see, Daddy, eh? Ada, Ada. Oh, yeah, come now, too. Yeah, yeah. Mama, see, mm -mm. don't bother yourself. See, you don't want to worry. I'll talk to your brother, eh? So that at least get back to you so that you tell him how to prepare. Mama, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Mama, it's not introduction. He's just coming to know you and brother. Yes, I know. We are saying the same thing. The way you are sounding is, it looks like you want to invite people coming. Please, don't it's worry. not introduction. Hey, don't bother yourself. See, I'll prepare a phone number. Don't worry. As you can see, let me go. I don't want to go. Let me go and check what Melinda is doing in the kitchen. Melinda, what are you doing? My mother, no, don't go and invite people coming. What? Mama, mama, is. Um, she said he will be here in two days. Then we will see him and entertain him. Mom, I thought you said he wasn't coming for the main introduction, right? Mm -hmm. So, what's the need for the introduction or cooking? I think it's a normal thing to cook. It shows that we value and respect his presence. Um, the only problem is that I will not be available on that day. Why? 
This is very important to our family. She's our, your only sister. Mama have a surgical operation on that day and a consultation too. Since it's not an introduction, I think it's fine. <sighs> okay. Kachi, uh, since uh, Desmond will not be at home to host him, mm -hmm. then you and your wife will do all the preparations. Okay? <laughs> the only issue now is um, I don't know if she'll be at home or she'll visit one client. No problem, I will talk to my wife so that we'll make the necessary preparations. Mm -hmm. I'll also be there. I'll be there to make sure that everything, you know, it's is not well, well prepared. Mm -hmm. In my manner, I don't say. I am my mother. So, see how you've been taking care of my brother. Oh, <laughs> thank God. <laughs> thank God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's okay. By the way, Felicia, I heard that someone is coming to pay your bride price. Please tell me about him. No, I don't want to tell you. Come on now. <laughs> okay, fine. Yes, um, his name is Harry. Okay. He's a businessman and I met him while I was seven. Oh, really? At first year, I thought he was one of those regular guys that just want to come in and out. You know what I, I mean? Know. Then I noticed he started talking differently. So I'm like, why not? So let's see how it goes. Yeah. So um, tell me. Do you love him and does he love you back? <laughs> he has been showing me so much care. So, I think I like him. Ah, <laughs> you started. I said love. See, love is very important in a relationship, okay? So tell me, does he love you? Do you love him? Or it's just like, so that is, I don't know where I want. Okay, you. fine. <laughs> it's okay, you got me right there. Fine. Um, at first, I... I think I loved him first, then I realized that he loves me more. So yeah, it kind of works. <laughs> My congrats. I'm so happy for you. Thank you. Because I can tell from, you know, your responses and everything. I can tell that he's a nice and caring man, right? Oh, he's extremely caring. He treats me like a queen. Uh, sometimes like a baby. Do you know what? But was queen, baby. Oh, he's He's nice. You're so lucky. You're so, I so know. lucky. Congrats. Thank Let's you. Let me tell you one secret. Ah. See, you see, the way you've gotten this man, make sure you hold him tight. Yes, because you see all these city girls, their eyes are like eagles. If they set their eyes on a good man, that is it. He's gone. So you better hold him tight. Don't say I didn't tell you. Okay, wait, wait. Are you saying there's husband or boyfriend scarcity in Lagos? Well... <laughs> wait, is that how you heard my brother? I did not. I did. I did not. Say okay, that. fine, fine. I've heard you. I'm going to hold him tight. Look at my nails now. Why do you think I have these nails? Let them come. I will scratch their face. I trust you. <laughs> oh my God. I'm so so happy for you. Congrats. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. So, Harry, this is my mom. I'm sure you've seen her lots on those pictures mm -hmm. I usually show you. So, Mom, meet Harry. Nice to finally meet you in person, Mama. Send me a message. Thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Go and call your brother. Tell him that our guest is here. All right, you're welcome. Mm -hmm. Just Make yourself comfortable. You should come back soon, okay? No problem. Mm. <laughs> Since you said so you want to yeah. you said you want to say you're coming from my sister, you'll have brought one from <laughs> <laughs> very good. So let's make a toast. What do you guys think? Uh, so to what exactly? Mm. I mm. I mm. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Are 
So where are you from? <clears throat> I'm from Emono in Delta State. What part? The Igbo speaking part. That's a Kwani. Oh, nice. You know, I've been to a place called um, Abo. And also I've been to this place called, what was this place? Abraka. Abraka, Abraka yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. When I was seeking admission in their state university mm. back in the days. Mm, gotcha. So you still remember? <laughs> Actually. <those days. laughs> so what do you do for a living? I work with an oil company in Port Harcourt. Wow. That's but nice. most times I'm offshore. Oh, that's good. Interesting. Once again, you're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Ezra, I hope you have good plans for my sister. Yeah, definitely. Trust me with her. See, <laughs> <laughs> this one, I don't know. No, no, please. <laughs> uh -huh. Felicia, mm. you need to start to take care of yourself, especially your body system. Mama, I'm not a child. Of course, I take good care of myself. Can't you see? Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're beautiful. I know. As beautiful as your mother. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know you don't understand what I mean, but I am here to help you. <laughs> you need to start taking good care of your womb. Hmm? To be so that you can receive whatever he deposits and make good use of it. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Don't worry. I want to get something for you. Uh, um, no, this one is not for you. It's for your husband. This one. You see this one? You will boil it and drink it. Hold on. Eh? When you boil it and take it, this one will make your womb receptive and fertile. Hmm? So that at least um, when you get married in one year, you will call me for Mugo. Oh, we are not married no. yet now. <laughs> That's why I'm preparing you for the day. Eh, yes. Mm -hmm. Hold this one. Mm -hmm. This one. This one is for him. He will put water. Or gin, like snap, whatever he likes. Mm? You put inside and then drink. This one will make him agile and active. Wait, no. Oh, mama, we hey, hold on, I know. That's why I'm preparing you before time. Do you understand? Uh -huh. This one will make him agile and active. Oh. So that he will shoot without missing. And you will catch and hold it oh. firm. Yes. Mama, I'm not going to take any of this. <clears throat> See, I'm preparing before time, so there won't be any issues. Catch up, yeah? yeah that's, uh -huh. that's true, actually. You know, um, you guys need to give us a chance. <coughs> okay. Mama, you are mm -hmm. very correct. Mm -hmm. Very correct. <laughs> Brother Kachi, you know you're already married. Of course. And ever since you got married, no evidence. So, I think, Mama, you are mistaken. You, know, you are giving the wrong person this medical uh, 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 or traditional medicine. Hmm? So, over to you, brother. I'm sure by the time you try it, you and brother this mode, and it works. Harry will not hesitate to, to try it. <laughs> Something is wrong with you. How dare you direct this nonsense towards me? Did I tell you I have any medical problem? You know why you're angry now? Too often to be angry, Mama, that, that gave the wrong person. One more word from you, and I will throw you out of this house. I'm not going anywhere. Okay. It's okay, Mama. Yeah. 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 I said I'm going to leave you. I said I'm going to leave you. you and now, God, that's why. Shut up, shut up. Are you catch yourself? I was just joking. I did, I did, I did. Bitch. We are six weeks pregnant. What? Me? Oh my God! 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 Yeah. <laughs>
Yo, when he told me I am pregnant, oh. I did not know how to react. In fact, I didn't know how to contain my joy. Oh, my friend, I am so happy for you. Ah, what God cannot do does, does not exist. Ah, a very patient woman. And God has answered you at the end. Thank I'm God. so happy. I'm so... I just thank God so much for answering me. And you see, this is why I love my mother-in-law. She's simply the best. <laughs> you know what? What? Hold on, let me go get us wine to celebrate. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. I cannot wait. Mother to be. I want soon to be mother. for their hot spots. Eh? Haven't you heard? Oh, let me tell you. <laughs> You've not heard that Belinda is pregnant. Yes, she is. She is a real wife. Eh? Stay here. Stay here, continue to eat and get thin every day in my son's house. I don't know what my son's trip into. I don't even know. Anyways, mm, only God knows if there are still eggs left in that womb of yours. For God. I'm on time. He has no for us, he has no for us, he has no for us, he has no for us. Why do you look so excited? You've not heard. Belinda is pregnant. Oh, God. Yes, do I need another reason to get me excited? I am super excited. That's why I am celebrating. What my father cannot do. Okay, you know that saying, you know, when you celebrate other people's victories and wins, you tend to attract yours. So this is me celebrating for them, for us to attract us. And finally, we get to hear the cry of a baby in our family. In our family. What's my wife can do? to be a us? What's my father can do? He's giving you something. Hey, you know you don't love me. Show me what you love me. Is it in my head or you don't feel excited about my pregnancy? How do you mean? I don't know, but I don't feel any form of excitement from you. I don't know how you expect me to react. 
perhaps you want me to write it on my forehead that my wife is pregnant. It's okay, baby. Maybe I'm just too excited not to notice your own excitement. I'm sorry if you feel offended by what I said. It's all right. I know you. <laughs> you are food. Yes, don't you. You are food. Yeah, I am chef. Mm. Uh, yes, 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 do something. Yeah. But I know you don't know. So, are you, are you okay? Are you okay? Sorry, sorry. In, in, in mama. <laughs> mama, mm? you are the chef. Keep my own. Keep my own. Oh, keep my own. <laughs> Mm. Thank you. 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 It's time to go and bring out our pregnant, beautiful wife. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Hey, no, 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 no. Sit. Mm, sit. Um, let her go, wife, go and escort her here. Yes, now. She needs to be youthful. Eh? <laughs> eh? Cool. At least the grace. Ah, what is that? I'm going to the grace will fall upon you. Get off now. Get off. Get off. All right. Be fast about it, okay? Ouch. Ah, yeah. she comes. Yeah. Let's make it cold. Yes, yes, yes. Are you doing? Yes. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. See what the Lord has done. So, let me let me spot. See what the Lord has done. What, what he waited for has come to pass. See what the Lord has done. Come on, come on. I don't understand. Hi. How do I look? You look beautiful. Pregnancy looks so good on you. Are you sure? You sure I look good? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Olivia, don't worry, okay? The God that did this for me after five years of struggling will do yours for you in no time, okay? Anyways, let's not spoil your day, okay? Today, it's your day. So let's go downstairs. Everyone is waiting for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're going to love it? <laughs> let's go. Let's go. <sighs> My God. Oh, oh she, wow, yeah, well, she well, comes. Well, yeah, she comes. Yeah, she comes. Yeah, she comes. Amazing. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll go first. So, I got you a special beautiful gift. Yes, and starting with the one, um, the one wrapped in red, I got you this special fine pink dress. And I can't wait to watch you rock this pink dress with your baby bum, you understand? Because I know it's going to look very beautiful. But I didn't stop there. There's this special pink Shoe, I got you to match the pink dress. You know, you know, this is not pink now. Ah, ah, but I did not stop there. So, I also placed an order for you one special diamond stone rocky dress like that. But trust me, it's always delivered to you as soon as it arrives. And I did not also stop there. So, I transferred two million naira into your account. Two million naira? Yes. Thank you so much. Please, wait, this one. This one? So, what's that now? What's the meaning of this? 
What if something happened to pregnancy? No, no, no. What if something happened to my own child? What? What? Oh. Uh, uh, you're being so insensitive right now. You're being wicked. You're being childish for rubbing this to my face. Uh, <clears throat> Shit, I'm disappointed in you. Mm, I. What, what did you just say? I. Um, Hey, you think you me? What was the meaning of that drama right now? Meaning of what? Look, I'm not in the mood for this. Can you leave me alone? I will not leave you alone until you explain to me what your brother just said. What does it mean by I'm carrying his child and you said he's crazy for rubbing it in your face? What does that mean? Like I said, I have no explanation. I'm not in the mood right now. Leave me alone. This month, I will not leave you alone until you explain to me what your brother Kachi said. Belinda, there is no explanation. And if for any reason you need any explanation, go meet your loving mother-in-law to explain to you all that you seek for and that if she's nice enough to give you the answers that you seek. I don't understand it. Kachi, what did you just say to your brother, Kachi? What was the meaning of what you said? I don't, what did you mean by, by the baby is yours? I don't understand. Are you trying to say that the child Benina nice is carrying is your child? Kachi, just answer my question, okay, please! Wait, wait, wait. Hey, 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 Where you run to? Where you run to? You always run like the coward you've always been. Run! Yes, that's, that has always been what you've always done. Run! You've never for one day appreciated anything that's been done for you in your entire life. Oh, shut up! Kachi, shut up! You think you can come to my house and spill rubbish and I'll let you go scot free? I'll break your face Everybody if you don't. Everybody shut up! Okay. Mama. Mama. I need answers. Because Desmond told me you have all the answers. Explain to me, Mama, what is going on. Mama, because the way I feel right now, you don't want to know what I'm going to do in this state. Explain what? What do you want me to explain? Everything! Everything! Shut your mouth! Look at who is talking. What you cannot do, someone has did it for you. Mama! Mama, I have nothing to talk about. Mama, there is no escape on this one. Because I myself, I want to know what is going on here. And nothing is happening except for the fact that this one there is being ungraceful, is being such an ingrate. Thunder, fire you! Thunder, fire you! Thunder, fire you! Thunder, fire you! Stop it, you! Stop! What is wrong with both of you? Huh? This was supposed to be in the family. What is wrong with both of you? The two of you, you be two idiots. Who couldn't control their tongue and emotions. You have spilled it out. Now you're happy? Katie, you're happy? Wait. Oh. What are you talking about? Because what did the three of you do? Babe, why don't you go to a different hospital that has a very good lab? Take your husband's sample. You know, run some tests. You, you must not tell him. What if, what if he later finds out? At least we know what the problem is. You have to run some tests. You know? So we, we know if we have to look for another medical means of getting a child. Ah. I'll think about it. Ah, that is the problem I have with you. You are always thinking when you're supposed to be acting. Belinda, you are not getting any younger. For the fact that your mother-in-law is not troubling you, for troubling your co-wife. <laughs> it means that there is something she's waiting for. And when that grace expires, hey, <laughs> my dear, she will show you shaggy. You will not even believe your eye. Better act fast. We need to act fast. This family needs a child. So that your father's name will not be waste. We, we understand this month's condition now. Uh, 
expecting an heir from him is impossible. So I have a plan. Which is? Catching here will get the job done on Belinda. What are you saying, Mama? That my younger brother sleeps with my wife? Mama, that's an abomination. It's impossible. Abomination is when something happens to both of you and there is no means of continuing your father's lineage. That's it's an abomination. Um, it's not a usual kind of thing, if you ask me, Mommy. But still and still, I don't see anything wrong with me at all. Yes, because at the, at the end of the day, it's just me and um, if we we'll do it and we finally have the child, you understand? The child happens to be the family's child, you understand? And the child bears our name, Okwa Fankai Kogaza. So it's just me helping the brother out here, you understand? So I'm going to for the name of Yes, I'm going to for the name But you are mad. To ever think that this will happen, you are crazy. What can we help make this? That's what. Mama, is this why you called this meeting? Is it not enough? This meeting is over. This one, no, come back here. This one, sleep with my wife. This one, come back. My younger brother. This one, Mama. Mama, if you have come to convince me, don't even bother. Because there's no way I will agree to that sinful act. Desmond, I am not trying to convince you to accept our plan. No, that's not why I'm here. But I need you to know that your wife is about to consult other doctors and laboratories, yes, to know what the real problem is. Yes, and to know if all the results we've been showing is true. So tell me, what happens if she discovers that you're impotent, that you can't father a child? What choice is left for you? What is the guarantee that she will still want to remain your wife? For how many years you have been deceiving that girl? Hmm. Ah, Desmond, what will people think or say about you and our family? Hmm? Now, it is your turn to decide what the real abomination is. You are the men we have in this house. And both of you are not thinking like men. I am the one doing the thinking and you don't see the sense in it. Hey, mommy. Of course I am seeing the sense in what you're trying to say. It's this one that is just acting weird. Like Namotra just like that. Come on, it's just me trying to be a team player. Yeah. So you're just acting up. Whichever way the child comes, the child is in the family. The most important thing is that we have a child in the family. Is that not? Yes. yes. And it's, it's the same child. The same child is my focus here. And nothing more. Since since the wife is fertile. Since the wife is fertile and I am also fertile, you understand? We match together and we reproduce. And the baby's name Nafa Nafa in Kwako de Konya. I can you quack me. I can back can me. So what's there? So mama, what's the plan? <laughs> Do you think that Belinda and Olivia will ever agree to this? I mean, how do we even inform them in the first place? Now you're talking. 
Of course. No one will tell them, oh, will you? Hmm. See, Desmond, what I want you to do for me is just let me know when your wife is menstruating. Then leave the rest for me. I will handle it, okay? Take. Take. Why a drink? Yes, sir. A drink now. Ah, see. You need to be taking this mixture to get ready. It is very important that you don't miss your target. Just one shot. We are sure. You don't need to go for another action. Huh? Mommy, there will be need to. Once in a while, I think we need to make the same arrangement to top up what I will be depositing there. Uh -uh. Mba, this one will be doing the top. What? what kind of this one is that? You want a man that is sterile to contaminate the good work that I'm going to do. Mba, go. Ah, don't talk to your brother like that. Don't talk about your brother like that. That everywhere they be flying day and night, eh? Searching for how to hear gossip. We are drinking. Drink now. Hey, drink. Finish it all. Bolo, mom. Um, what are you cooking? Oh. Mama, hmm? you're here. Why? Now you didn't even call me. Why? Mama, I want you to rest today. I want to be the only one in the kitchen. Okay, thank you. But I want to tell you something. What is it, Mama? Uh, one of my friends gave me something. Uh, she said her daughter-in-law used it when she was finding it difficult to, to get pregnant. And then, uh, probably she used it and it worked. So let's give it a try. Huh? Let's see if it will work for us. Mm? And I want you to do something for me. Uh, once it is two days to your ovulation, just let me know. I will give you the herbal mixture to take. Oh? Okay, Mama, it's fine by me if it will work. Of course, it will work. Be positive. I believe it worked for them. It will work for us. Just be positive, okay? Okay, Mama. Yeah. Thank you so much. <laughs> you said I should, I should see. Okay. If you said I should go and rest. No, well, not today. Let me eat in case you call like a way. Oh my god, Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, see, call for my own. All right, Mama. Mpulo, Mam. Uriya, Kunji, Jemba. You know, never check all of them. The mixture I told you about. Mm -hmm. Drink it, white wine. Drink, drink everything. Finish mm. everything. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Thank you. Oh, go straight to your room. Your husband is there waiting for you. Just go there. You meet him there. Get intimate with your husband. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Mama. Thank you for coming. Thank you.
Mama, she's asleep now. You can go ahead and do whatever you want to do. Wait, Mama. Isn't there any other way? I mean, how about artificial insemination? Yes, you know, that one will take time. Eh? And you don't even know the statement of the person that's going to use. You don't, you don't understand, you're a medical doctor now. Mm -hmm. Plus, I think someone still remains in the family, you understand? Yes. Yeah. She doesn't wake up, okay? No problem. Helping his elder brother get his wife pregnant mm -hmm. after all, he still remains in the family. Mm -hmm. Mama, are you, are you kidding me? So you don't see anything wrong in what you did to me? You violated me, Mama! You were ganged up to rape me and you do not see anything wrong with this! No, we didn't do that. Yeah. Kachi here is as much husband as your attachment. So Mama, we are shut up! Mama, just shut up. Yeah. I, 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 no, 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 no. So I want to watch you and I will stand here and witness you disrespect my mom right in front of me, Olivia. Can you shut up? Yes, shut up. Me? Okay? You're so shameless. You're so shameless. You're being very shameless. I can't even believe that you're still talking in a situation like this, Kachi. I can't believe you're so shameless. Obi, baby, I know nothing about this. Believe me, baby. Okay, look at that. No, it's all making sense. Mama, so all the love you have been showing Belinda is because you knew your son was the problem. No, that's not what's the problem. <laughs> How did I not see this? Now I know why you've always wanted to control their marriage. So they can listen to you and follow whatever it is that you say to them. <laughs> see the brothers, or see the men I have as brothers. Men who can't even take decisions for themselves. They are not even man enough to take any decision for themselves, Mama. What did you do? See how you succeeded to ruin? You ruin everything. So ashamed to call you all my family. Shut your mouth, Felicia. Felicia, come back here. I didn't even know how I got myself to accept this madness. You should be thankful. Yes, yes. What is? I am not my family. Felicia, when a man is getting married to a woman, he's also getting married to her family. Thank you. 
Kensha, Kensha, where are you going to? Anywhere is but certainly not this house. Okay, let's go together. Are you going my way? Yeah, I'm, I'm sure I am. Let's go. for all they did to me. They can't ruin my life and go scot free. Are you sure you want to do this? You know you're pregnant. And they're your family. I don't care. They can rot in jail. I really don't care. And who will stand by you while you're doing this? We are going to stand by her. Olivia, Alicia, how did you? We were driving past and we saw your car parked. Olivia, I'm sorry. I'm not mm -hmm. a party to this whole thing. No, 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 Belinda, you don't have to be sorry, okay? We, we were both betrayed, okay? I should be the one telling you sorry for what Kaki did to you. And see, so trust me, we're going to make sure you get justice and we're going to make sure they are both punished, okay? I'm so sorry. Belinda, I am so sorry about what my family did, okay? I have no idea this was going on. I'm so sorry. Sorry. You and Mama caused all of this. No, we did not cause anything, best man. It's the jealousy that was written all over your face because the child your wife is carrying belongs to me. Oh! Yes. Really? Yes. From the start, you and Mama have been rubbing this to my face. You've been forcing me to accept things that I'm against. Taking decisions without even asking me first. All because of what? Because you're helping me get a child? Is that what you want to feel everything with your uncle? Kachi! Yeah. Is that why? Kachi? Yes. If you would be doing this while she's still pregnant, tell me it means you will do much, much no, worse no. when the baby is born. Mama, yeah, no. Oh, yeah, no, no. Eh? It means that one day you come asking me to give you the baby back because it belongs to you. And Mama here yeah, will support you. No. So, Mama, no, 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 you, you, Mama, Mama, stop all this. So, when Mama was, when Mama made the plans and arrangement, that's not what did you do? Uh -huh. Did you object? Uh -huh. So, not you standing here, raising your voice like a town crier and schooling me and telling me what to do? If that's for your foolishness and your cowardice, everything hey. will be fine. That's more. Instead of me, this rat is talking to. I will remember. I'll put that in memory. This one. In memory. In memory. Stop. Officer, this is Kachi. Yeah. Kachi, Mr. Susan Mama Kachi. Yeah. 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 Mr. Kachi Odo, you are under arrest for raping Mrs. Belinda Odo. Mr. Desmond Odo and Mrs. Uzoma Odo. You are under arrest for aiding and abating rape. No, I, I, you not have the right to remain silent as whatever you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. No, please, 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 you can't do this now. Please, you can't do this. No, he's not I can't do this. It's not rape now. He, he, he didn't rape her. Just say, it's just say, brother, heaven, brother, I need you. Please, Olivia. Explain to them. Please, please, please. If you're different, they will understand, please. Officer, officer, yes. this is a civil matter. Yes. I'm sure we can discuss this yeah, yeah. men to men. Yes, okay. yes. Get them! Ah. Hey, officer, officer. Take them, take them out. Move! Yes, my mom, it's my mom. Move! My mom, she put me to me. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. This is my mom. Hey, Mrs. Baby, you know I love you. Baby, baby, I'm not proud of you, so. You know I love you. See how you've succeeded in ruining all our lives. What kind of a mother are you? When did you... When did you become this way? Because I know my mother. You never raised me like this. The kind of a mother who gave me to a daughter. What 
can want to hold her own family, but take sides with outsiders. God will never allow me to support people with evil intention. Do you know what you have done? Because of you. The man who wanted to marry me left me. Seeing the shameful family I came from. wonder you never liked Olivia because you couldn't manipulate her and you deceived Belinda making her feel loved cared for meanwhile you wanted to use her as your experimental animal mama I am so ashamed to call you my mother right now I don't blame you. What do you know? You won't understand. I must have done evil in my life to have a daughter like you. I think I'm so sorry. So what are you going to do now? Especially with the child you're carrying. I really don't know what I'm going to do. But all I know is that I will not abort this child because of the evil family I got married into. My child is my child. And I will raise this child myself. Yeah. I understand and I, I think that's the right thing to do. Well, for me, I'm, I'm in touch with the lawyer. I am, I'm fighting for a divorce. But you know, I can't... I can't be with a man that, that can do such evil to someone else. A man that is always acting like a boy around his mother. I can't. I'm done with all of the insults and all of the frustration I had to go through simply because I'm in a marriage with him. I, I'm done. Now I understand the love and care that she was showing me. She did it because she wanted to use me and she succeeded. My friend warned me but I didn't listen to her. Hey. Oh. I thought you left. Hey, falling in love with you was never a mistake. You are a girl with a pure soul. So what if your parent did what they did? You should not take responsibility for their actions. What are you talking about? I love you, baby. And I want to spend the rest of my life with you. I want to go to bed knowing that I would wake up right next to you. I want to share my pain and my happiness with you. What are you talking about? Do me the honor of being my wife. 